Hey class, uh, this is our last official workout before our final fitness test. And it is a little bit different than others. We're not going uh, as long as we usually have in the past, but it is still about 27 to 30 minutes uh, long. So it's not that much shorter. However, we're only going two intervals and we're still sticking with the six exercises for each interval, but just two times, two or two intervals, three times through. Um, so I think what we've been doing is we've been going uh, three intervals, two times through. Um, all of them. So um, the workout is pretty much an overall body uh, workout with um, a little more um, focus on the strength part. Uh, with the testing coming up for the second workout this week, uh, we really kind of want you to be fresh, right? So testing to the best of your ability, see if we can see some improvements um, from the last time. So within this interval, you'll have um, some back stabilizer exercises and some abdominal, abdominal exercises. So pretty much four either cardio, upper body, or lower body exercises, okay? All right, let's get to this final one. It'll be a good one, knee pulls. and you're fresh and ready to go, high knees. Can't believe it's almost over and summer is already here. Holy moly. Arm swings across. And up and down. And hips. Other leg. And body swings. And lunge. legs good and roll ups on the toes back on the heels so there are let's see there's one exercise in each interval that you can use maybe like some dumbbells. Go ahead and step back, push the heel down and the hips down or some uh, weight plates or even just maybe, you know, a couple of water bottles holding them um, just to add some resistance. Switch arm or switch legs. So it's the second exercise of each interval where I'm gonna use the weight plates and so I'll cue you in if you want to add some weight to it. Switch legs. Um, you can do that. Okay. <clears throat> so just another, you know, idea for you if you want to do circuit training on your own. Switch legs. Um, adding weight to the upper body is always good. So building strength and muscle. All right. So, uh, first exercise of the first interval. These are squat jack touchdowns. So we've done these before. So squat jack, feet come in, feet come out into the squat. You touch down with the hand, okay? If you can't reach all the way to the floor, you can reach maybe to the ankle or just down the center, okay? All right. Let's go for 45 seconds, squat jack touchdowns, go. Try to keep your back flat, butt down, like you're sitting in a chair. So this is cardio and lower body. My 
shoes already untied. And stop. Good. Okay, second exercise. If you want to grab some weights, you can. So this is a bent over T. So the T with the arms just looks like this. So my arms come out at my sides straight, okay? We add the bent over, this bent over at the hips, weights start down, and we're lifting up to our sides, okay? So if you're not using weights, if you want to create resistance, squeeze, make fists, and really try to tighten the arm muscles, squeeze the shoulder blades at the top, okay? So we're gonna do those bent over T's, four of those. So it'll look like this. One, two, three, four from here, staying in this bent over position. Bent over position, we're gonna do a deadlift. And so I'm just basically bending my knees and touching down and coming back up. So I'm gonna lift something up off the ground, okay? We're gonna do four of those. Got it? So we're alternating between the two. Four T's, four deadlifts, ready? Go. your back flat the whole time through. So it's a little different than a squat. Mostly back doing the work, a little bit of leg movement. One more set. It's like a hinge. And we're done. All right. Third exercise. We're going to go down into bulldog. We know that. Our knees are bent and our knees are off the floor, right? Um, arm pulls, hop back, hop in. So watch me. This is bulldog. We're pulling one arm, pulling the other arm, hopping back into plank hopping back into bulldog, okay? You can step back and step forward if you want, uh, but we're gonna stay in that position the whole time through, okay? For 45 seconds, ready, go. Pull, pull, back, in. Pull, pull, One more. Good. All right. I'm going to go ahead and stand up. Fourth exercise. We're going to back lunge, mini lunge pulse. So watch me. I'm going to back lunge with my left leg, and then I'm going to pull this foot forward, but still keeping my back knee against my front knee, I'm going to pulse here. One, two, okay? Bring it forward, other leg. Back lunge, pull it in, two. Back lunge, pull it in, two. Okay? All right. 45 seconds. Ready? Go.
so we're going to go down for bridge. If you want, you can bring your weights, plates, or dumbbells with you. It's up to you. So this is going to be a combination exercise. We're going to be bridging, but we're also going to be chest pressing. And the chest press is going to be wide. So we're coming out from outside the elbows and we're going to press up into the center, okay? And I come back down and I go back up. All the while, I am bridging. So I'm going to bridge. Watch me hold this. And I'm going to chest press one, two, and come down. And then I'll do it again, okay? So we're bridge holding, two chest press, and coming down for each one. Ready? And go. Bridge. Come down. Bridge. And down. Of course, if you're not using weights, just create resistance. Bridge. Bridge. Good. All right. Last exercise, abdominals. So we are doing a sit-up with a reach back. If you cannot do a sit-up, then you are trying to get, you're doing a half sit-up. So you're trying to get half of your back up off the mat. So watch me. Reaching back, legs are bent. I'm going to sweep my arms and come up. If I cannot come all the way up, this is what it should look like. Okay, so again, when we lift up, we want to press that low back down into the mat and then pull those hips up or use those hips to pull yourself up. Okay, for 45 seconds, ready, go. Last one. Good. Get some water if you need it. Stand up. <clears throat> so the second time through, we're going to go three and three. So back to back to back, a little bit of rest, back to back to back. Okay? So we have squat jack, touchdown bent over T's in the deadlifts, and then our bulldog arm pull, hop back, hop in, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and get ready to go. I'll let you know, we'll cue you in to grab your weights, if you're gonna use your weights. Starting with squat jack, touchdown, ready, go. Next one will be our bent over T's, alternating with deadlifts, four and four. So if you want to grab your weights, do that now. Ready? 
here we go. Yes. Cheese. Yes. After this, we'll go into our bulldog arm pulls. Yes. Good. Put your weights down. Come on down. Bulldog position. Ready? Go. Pull. Pull. Get rest after this. Last one. Good. All right. Little rest. Next three will be our lunge, mini lunge, pulse, followed by our bridge, and then our sit ups. All right. Get ready. Back lunge, mini lunge, pulls, alternating. Ready? Go. The next one, you can grab your weights if you want. This will be our last back lunge. Good. Come on down. Bridge. Chest press. Ready. Bridges are great for hamstrings and glutes and low back. So I'll never underestimate bridge exercises, especially if you can combine some legs and some arms. Last one. Good. All right, weights down. Here we go. Sit-ups with reach back or half sit-ups. Ready? Go. This will be our last one, and then you can get some water. Stand up. All right, this time we're going to go six in a row, no rest, and then we'll get some rest.
All right, so we're gonna start, this is the last time through. We'll go all six in a row, starting with squat jack, touchdown. Ready, go. So we'll do those bench over tees with deadlifts, four and four. So if you want to grab your weights after this is over, you can. Last one. Good. Grab your weights. Ready? After this will be our bulldog arm pull. So last set. Good. Weights down. Bulldog. After this, we'll stand up for our back lunge exercise. Last one here. Good. Stand up. Ready? Go. Stay with me. After this will be our bridge hold chest press with or without weights. Last one here. Good. Come on down. All right. Here we go. Bridge, press, press, good, bridge, Last one. And weights down. All right, sit ups. Reaching back. Ready? Go. Get rest after this.
on its way and get some water. Nice. One down, one to go, you guys. Good job. <clears throat> so the next interval, same kind of idea, right? We're going to start with a dynamic squat exercise. So uh, this one's going to be a pulsing squat with a jump. We've done this before. So our arms are down when we're pulse squatting. Then when we jump, our arms come down. So watch me. So it looks like this. Pulse, squat, jump. Pulse, squat, jump. Okay? Um, that is our first exercise for 45 seconds. Are you ready? Here we go. Pulse, squat, jumps. Ready? Go. Again, keeping your back flat, your heels on the ground, butt down. Jump very high, just leave the ground. Ooh, we last one. All right. If you want to grab weights, grab weights. So these are bent over rows with lunges, side lunges. So a bent over row, so we were doing T's. Now we're pulling our elbows back next to our body. See that? Bent over rows, elbows close to your side. So we have four of those, and we're gonna go into four side lunges, two on each side. So after our rows, we're gonna go lunge, alternate, lunge, Two more times. Okay? All right, here we go. Four and four. Ready? Go. Again, create resistance if you don't have weights. Exercise, we're down for high plank, and we're going to go jack feet, which we've done with the squat jacks, right? So it's just out and in, out and in with the feet, and then we're going to go into blast offs. We've done this exercise before, it looks like this plank, jack feet, jack feet, pull it back in the blast off. Okay, no push ups today because I want you fresh for your inch warmers next time. All right, here we go. Ready? Two and one. Go. Last one. Good. Stand up. <sighs> All right, so we have next exercise is a back lunge exercise, but we're combining it with a power knee 
So I think we did this a long time ago. Watch me. I'm going to step back and lunge here. And then when I step forward, I'm going to pull my knee up. Okay? So it looks like this with balance. So it's lunge, pull, lunge, pull. And then we're going to switch sides. Okay? All right. Two on each side, back lunge, power knee. Ready? Go. Make sure you're alternating. Take it slow if you need to. Our last one, or last two, I should say. Good. Whew, that's a tough one. All right, we're gonna come on down. Two exercises down here on the mat. So we have a side plank cross over into reach up. So watch me. You can do this. With both knees bent and hips off the mat, okay? Or bring this top leg straight, bottom leg bent. Or if you're feeling like it's a challenge, you can bring both legs straight. That's really challenging. So I would keep one leg bent and the other leg on top straight. This is what it's gonna look like. I'm gonna lift my hips, and from here I'm going to reach up and I'm going to pull my hips down and rotate under my armpit and reach up. And we'll go half time on this side. You can keep both legs bent and then we'll switch for the other side, okay? All right, here we go. Find your position, ready, go. We are rotating the trunk up and down. And stop. Switch sides. Ready? Hips up, go. And stop. Good. Last exercise. We are on our backs. So these are our abs. This is a combination move as well. We're going to stay on one side for half the time. So follow along with me. I am going to extend my left arm out. I'm going to bring my right hand behind my neck. Okay. Now I'm going to keep my right leg bent and grounded. It does not do the work. My left leg does the work. I'm going to pull my left knee in as I come across with my right elbow. I'm going to extend that leg out and lift the leg in reach. So it's in, elbow to knee, up, hand to foot. Okay? We're going to stay on one side for half time and then we'll switch and I'll talk you through the next side, okay? All right, here we go. Ready, alternating. Go. Last one. Left hand behind the head, right arm out, left leg ecstatic, we're moving the right knee. Ready? Go. Knee. Leg. Last 
last one here. Woo wee. Oh, that's a good one. All right, get some water if you need it. One down, two to go. All right, so this time through, we're going three and three. You get a little rest in between your first and your second group of three exercises. The first three starts with that pulsing squat and jump with the arms down, okay? This time, we're gonna squat, pulse, two, jump, two times, okay? Uh, and then we'll go into our rows with lunges, and then we'll go in with our high, go to our high plank jack feet, last up, and then we'll get some rest, okay? So two jumps on the pulsing squats this time through. Ready for 45 seconds, find your spot, and go. a big jump. Remember after this, you can grab your weights if you want for your rows and your lunges. Last one here. Good. So it's four rows, uh, four total side lunges. Ready? Go. Last one, and then we'll go down for plank jack feet, blast offs. Good, come on down. Find your position. Ready? Go. after this. Last one. rest here. Next three, we have back lunge with the power knee, right? Two on each side. And then we'll go down for our side plank crossovers and then our opposite knee, opposite leg pulls. All right, here we go. Back lunge, power knee, two on each leg. Ready? Go.
those knees down or one leg up. Hips up. Ready? Go. Last one. Switch sides. Hips up. Ready? Go. On your backs, let's do those knee leg crosses. All right, let's go. Left arm down, right hand behind the head, right leg is static. We're working the left leg. All right, here we go. Ready and start. switch left hand behind the head right arm out left leg is static right leg is doing the work ready here we go Last one. And get some water if you need it. Two down. Woo! One to go. you guys six in a row here okay um, stay with me this is it this is the whole workout right here six exercises which basically is four and a half minutes that's it uh, and then we're gonna stretch and we're be we will be done so pulsing squat two jumps okay we're gonna go three pulse squats two jumps so one additional pulse squat Sticking with the two jumps. Okay? Here we go. Three and two. Ready? Go. Remember, this is the last time you do all of these exercises. So when you're done with this one, that's it. this if you want to grab your weights you can for the rows and lunges. This will be our last set here. That's it. That exercise is done. Grab your weights. Rows and lunges.
your last step here. And then we'll go high plank jack feet into blast offs. Here we go. Come on down. So we're going to go two and two this time. Two jack feet, two blast offs. Here we go. power knee two and two go this we go down for our side plank and abs and we'll be done last one here Whew. good job come on down both legs bent or one leg bent here we go half time here hips up arm up go one and switch hips up arm up go We're almost there you guys Last one. Good. On your backs. This is it. All right, left arm out. Right hand behind your neck. Right leg is static. Left leg does the work. Here we go. one. All right, left hand behind the neck, right arm out, left leg is static, right leg does the work. Here we go. This is it. Last one. Yes. Woo! -hoo. Nice job. All right, let's bring both knees in. Pull those knees in. Release that back. You did it. We did it. Nice job. All right, feet on the ground. We're gonna go ahead and keep these legs bent, bring our arms out to our sides, and I'm just going to let my knees fall to my sides. Get 
a lot of torso trunk work. We're just stretching out our sides here. Bring the knees back to center. Let them fall to the other side. Go knees back to center and go ahead and bring your arm over, knees over, push yourselves up here. And from here, we're going to go into our V, lean forward. Center, other side, back to center. All right, hurdler stretch. So we're going to bend this one leg, keep the other leg extended, and we're just going to lean back so we can feel that stretch through the hip into the quad. legs, lean back, and legs in front, forward stretch, and butterfly. Come forward, legs in front, arm across. Other arm. And we're done. Nice job. Okay, so the next workout will be our fitness test. So listen up. So I'm going to put up a video of the fitness test again, okay? You're going to watch the fitness test. You're gonna follow along with the fitness test. You're gonna write down your results. I'll go over this again with the fitness test video. There's also going to be your fitness test that you need to plug in your numbers or insert your numbers that you get on the results for that third test, okay? So all the number threes. So I'll explain that again, but you'll see three things the video, which is not worth the, the points, you're just watching it so you, you can be reminded. Then there's going to be the fitness test, the results, that's where you submit those numbers on that sheet, okay? Um, and we'll talk about goals and everything. That's worth points. And then you'll have your final weekly connection, and that of course is a submission, and that is worth five points as well, okay, or in addition, okay? So that's it for today. Uh, I will see you next time. Good job.